dresses with plunging backlines to outfits with rows of shimmering gold chains. There's a strong message of freedom in Stella McCartney's Spring Summer 2000 collection for Chloe. It's really just sort of trying to give women what they want, you know, give, you know, women of the future the freedom to, to feel confident and to feel like they can just wear what they, how they're feeling and just kind of reflect what they're feeling. It's, it's, there's a bit for everyone. There's kind of, you know, beautiful print dresses at the beginning, then it goes into sort of very, you know, embroideries and funky little t-shirts and sort of hipsters and denim and gold chains and then sort of diamonds. So there's just a bit really for every kind of woman. McCartney likes to offer something for every woman, so she does a mix of separates and dresses, jeans with fringes, her standby t-shirts, but there are also outfits for more formal occasions. Some really good suits, actually. We, did, we um, developed our own tailoring fabric this season. It's incredible. I love it. Gradual shading um, yarn. It's amazing. It looks beautiful. Shading in colour or shading in, in strength? Shading in colour. It sort of goes from dark tone into light tone, and then it's all sort of placed strategically in the body. As you walk, you get a piece of dark and then light. It's kind of it's cool. McCartney says suits give her a chance to show off her tailoring. It's an opportunity she also gets with skirts in the collection. McCartney also makes a strong statement with prints. So I've got quite sort of floral pretty prints and then graphic prints and I've, I've actually put them on a more interesting base fabric. I don't want to just sort of stick them on a very simple fabric. I've got cotton voiles with sort of already woven yarn so there's a print on a texture and then on seersucker georgettes and then on on um, satin so and then i'm just taking different sections of the dress and putting them in completely different fabrics so, and different prints so it's a mixture of, of prints it's not just one solid print dress for the evening wear in her collection mccartney adds a touch of glitz with an assortment of jewels so there's a, a whole gold chain section which is kind of Evening, I guess. I mean, you're only going to wear it in the evening. But the real evening, the sort of finale stuff, is um, rhinestones and diamonds, but actual ma made as jewellery and attached to clothing. So it's really sort of diamond necklaces attached to um, to silks and things. So it's sort of, it's very, it's quite sparkly. But what we've done to make it look older, because I think it can look a bit sort of a bit too much if you have just fresh diamonds on the catwalk. So what we've done, we've sort of dipped them in dirt and put them in stuff and then brushed off the dirt to make them look old. Where do you think fashion is going? Towards femininity? Towards, more towards uh, what? I, I hope it's not going any, anywhere to be categorised. I hope it's just sort of going into all different sections and I hope, you know what I mean? I think that's sort of, for me, the most modern thing that we can do here is to let women just be themselves and to feel glamorous one morning, feminine one morning, grungy the next morning, you know, black the next day, just to sort of go with your inner self. That's designer Stella McCartney with her Spring Summer 2000 collection for Chloe. Yeah, 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 yeah.